Um, the crazy thing with this book is, like, a lot of times when I've read books that display gang life, you don't see the female aspect of this life. Like, most times these books focus on the men, but not Triggerdale. Triggerdale showed the women um, in this story like you you see the women set up other men for licks you see the women you know set up other men to be murdered and like that's crazy to me and like I know that you know there are female gang members that's not what I'm saying I'm just saying like it's never really shown in books um for me This book really showed me, like, sometimes, if you, not even sometimes, like, most times, if you're doing the crime, it's best to do it by yourself, because your co-defendant might turn on you. Like, I think a lot of Hancho problems problem was he was too trusting of the people around him. Hancho, you know he was bred in the street like he was and he lived by a street code all these people did but it was just you know the weaker ones who you know turn state evidence and for me that's crazy like you had females turning straight evidence against honcho you had people that he was defending turn state's evidence against him you had people who didn't even fuck with him turn state's evidence against him like it was just fucking crazy um i think my favorite part of the book was when honcho woke woke up in jail like i'm not gonna tell y'all why but just know that if you read this book by the end of book one you're gonna be scratching your head like what the fuck and for me book one was The book that really made me, you know, want to fight the author.